everyone, my name is Desiree and I'm the designer for Wellington based fashion label, also called Desiree. Today I want to introduce you to a really beautiful piece from the Autumn Winter 2017 collection titled Gaijin. This item here is the side dress and it is a zero fa fabric waist item. So it means that once the fabric piece has been cut, absolutely nothing goes into the landfill. So it's a really sustainable way of creating items and I'm very excited to have included two different zero fabric waist pieces in this collection. So the reason that I wanted to introduce this piece to you via video is that there are tons and tons of different ways of wearing it and so I wanted to demonstrate a few. So let's get started. One way, so this is the most simple way but it looks really beautiful. So taking the, the front piece, just wrap it and tie it around the back, bring it to the front and tie it. You can tie it over in the middle or to the side, whichever feels comfortable. You can also do it loose or tight. And just grab the back ties, get to the front, and just overlap them. So that you've got oops, two different bows. So for the first way, we took the front pieces and we wrapped it all the way around. For the second way, what we do is just take it and have the back pieces match. So the first thing that you'll notice is that the hem changes and drops. This creates that really beautiful sort of handkerchief hem. This way, you can also do it a little bit looser and just have it really loose and drag it around. So it just moves really nicely. Oh, for this one, we're going to start with the back first. So just tuck your hands underneath, move it around, and then bring it to the back. I'm going to grab the front and we're going to bring it right the way around, move it over, doing the desired tightness. And we'll just like So, those are some of the really simple, easy ways that you've probably already thought of once you've picked up this item. But now we're going to get a bit more creative and try and change it in the ways. So, for this one, we're going to take the ties and we're just going to tie a bow in it. Just like so. And then up over there. Try and push these pieces to the back a little bit. This just adds this really beautiful little tie along here that leaves the rest all sitting as a nice beautiful simple dress that's easy to wear. And then grab these pieces and just gently put them to the front and tie it. Just like that. So what's really nice about this one is that you're seeing sort of the back side of the fabric which is quite unusual but it also creates a really beautiful contrast because you've got this line coming down here and then this one here which is just a little bit different. The other option, that same one, is that you can take it to the back and then just tie it like that. So then you've got, okay so now I'm going to show you another back detailing one. So for this one, Basic simple front, flipping along the back detail, got the crossover, and then you can see a little bit more of the slip underneath. Now I'm going to show you one of the slightly more complex and complicated ones, but still a really good one to demonstrate, and that is turning it into a top rather than a dress. Okay, so.
So for this one, what you've got to do is you want to grab the hem and tuck it up and under to whichever length you want it to be. So then what I'm doing is just pulling this back. Obviously this is a slightly harder one, it takes a little bit more fiddling, but if you've ever got an, eye, an outfit where you really need a top, this is what you've got, you love the colour, it completely matches, then it's worth the effort to turn it into a top. So there you go, those are just a few of the different ways that you can wear it, it seems like a lot, but there are countless more, and even as I'm having to play and demonstrating, I know that there are some that I've created before and can't remember. I remember exactly how to do it so this video is a great thing to refer back to if you're ever wanting to do something a little bit different can't quite remember how to do it then this video will hopefully help as a little tutorial guide hope you've enjoyed this video and i hope the tutorial has been helpful and most of all i really hope that you enjoy this dress and make the most of it and don't forget to send me some pictures or videos of different styles that you've created from it so i'd love to hear from you thanks have a lovely day